continuing from my last video on simplifying rational expression. I would like to do a few more examples. Uh, the principle is the same. You want to make the denominators equal. So here I look at this is the denominator 3x and this is x. So how can I make the denominators equal? So well, I say this is 3x. So can I make this into a 3x? So I say yes, I can. So if I multiply this with 3, I have to also multiply this with 3. Okay, basically you are multiplying by 1. So this becomes 1 over 3x plus 3 over 3x. Now the denominators are equal, so you can add the numerator. So it's 1 plus 3 over 3x. And that is nothing but 4 over 3x. And this is your answer. Okay, the next question. 1 over x squared plus 2 over x. Again, here you've got x squared, here you've got x. So can we make the denominators equal? But I say, well, this can be made in x squared by multiplying this with x. So if you multiply this with x, it will become x squared. So you have to also multiply the top. So this will become 1 over x squared plus 2x over x squared. And just to add them, I add the numerator, so 1 plus 2x over x squared. Now you can't simplify this any further. This is your most simplified form. Next question. x over 2 plus 1 over x. So I can say, okay, this is 2 and this is x. So can I make this 2x? So I can say yes, I can multiply this with x. So I have to multiply this with x. And if I multiply this with 2, I have to multiply this with 2. So this will become x squared over 2x plus 2 over 2x. Now the denominators are equal, so you can add the numerators or the top number. So that is x squared plus 2 over 2x, just like that. And this is your answer. Okay, here... Yeah. You have got a over 2 plus a over 3 times 1 quarter. So here you have to use the bed mass rule. You should be knowing the bed mass rules. That is, first you have to bra simplify brackets, exponent, division, multiplication, addition, and subtraction. So first you have to multiply. Okay, Before, you can't add. The first thing, first order of operation is multiply. So this will become a over 2 plus. When you're multiplying fractions, what you do is you multiply the top numbers and multiply the bottom numbers, that is the numerators and denominators. So this becomes a times 1 over 3 times 4. So this is a over 2, a over 2 plus a over 12. Now here you've got a 2 and here you've got a 12. So can I make this into a 12? So yes, I can. So I multiply this with 6. So I have to also multiply this with 6. So this will become 6a over 12 plus a over 12. Okay, does it make sense? Both the denominators are equal, so you can add the top number. So this is 6a plus a over 12. Now this is 6 lots of a and this is 1 lots of a, 1 lot of a. So this is 7a over 12, and this is your answer. Okay, can we have one more question? Yeah, so this is a over 4 minus a over 2. Here, uh, this is a over, not a, it should be some other number, so let me make up a number, so a over 5, okay. So yeah, again the rule is, you have to use the bed mass rule. So bed mass rule, you always start with the bracket, so you can simplify the bracket. So this will become, I'm going to make this into an 8, so I'll multiply this with 2, so to also multiply this with 2. So this is 2a over 8 minus a over 8 times a over 5. So this is nothing but 2a minus a over 8 times a over i. So this is a over 8 times a over 5.
part. You know, you're multiplying fractions, you multiply the numerators and multiply the denominators, just like that. So this is a squared over 40. This is your answer. Okay, uh, we have got one more question. This is 5a to the power 4. Uh, divided by this times 6 over a squared. So first I'm going to divide, change this into multiplication. So this is 5a to the power of 4 over 12b. Now, when you change the division into multiplication, you swap the numbers. So this will become 4b over, I'll explain this. Suppose you're, you're dividing, say, 2, um, Suppose, suppose you multiply, dividing 5 divided by 2 is same as 5, 2 can be written as 2 over 1. 5 divided by 2 is same as 5 times half. Okay, so the division, when you change the division into multiplication, this number swaps over. That is 2 over 1 will become 1 over 2. So 4b over 3 times 6 over a squared. So now this is pretty easy. You have to multiply the numerators and denominators. So this is 5a to the power of 4 times 4b times 6 over 12b times 3 times a squared. So let me multiply the numbers first. So 5 times 4. So let me write this like this. 5 times 4 times 6 times a to the power of 4 times b over 12 times 3 times a squared. Okay, so this is uh, 5 times 4 is 20 uh, and 20 times 6 is 120. Okay, so 120 times a to the power of 4 I can write as so I uh, missed a b here. So a squared times a squared times b over. Uh, I'll write this as 12 times 3 times a squared times b. Hopefully I've not made any silly mistakes. Yeah, I have got. So this b and b, b gets cancelled. a squared. 12 goes in 120 10 times. So my final answer would be 10 a squared over 3. Hopefully I am right. So this is the final answer. See you in the next video.